Namaste friends, welcome to my channel Physics Boy. Here you will get scientific explanation of many curious questions. You know, every human being are curious to get exact answer of their all curious questions. Today you are also curious to know is a full hard drive heavier or does the weight of a laptop or a mobile or hard disk change when you store more data on it. Friends, watch this video till the end because I am going to tell you the exact scientific explanation of this curious question. You know all the information or data that is stored in the hard disk is in the form of binary bits 0 and 1. Do all the things that we store in a hard disk or memory card like pictures, PDF, music or videos acquire some measurable mass or not? The standard answer in science is that the binary information does not have any mass that is the bits does not have any gravitational mass. So technically your answer is no that is the weight of the hard disk will not change when you store that data or information in the hard disk. But this is not the case the actual answer is yes. Now I am going to explain why I am saying yes, that is why I am saying the full hard disk drive is heavier than the empty hard disk drive. You know information or data is symbolic representation of reality. There are a lots of data present even in an empty hard disk. This data is called garbage data or random data. Whenever we put some useful data or information to a hard disk then we actually rewrite this garbage data. The weight of information or bits stored on magnetic memory, optical memory or flash memory is zero regardless whether it is full, half full or empty. Why? Because information on these devices is not stored as mass. If you look at the magnetic memories, information is stored in the form of magnetized regions on ferromagnetic materials with a measurable hysteresis. Mass has no role to play in these devices. If you look at the optical memories, information is burnt onto specially prepared surface with the help of lasers. No material is added or removed from the disk. If you look at the flash memories, information is stored in the form of variation in the thresholds of specially fabricated transistors. This variation is due to charge stored at the gates of the transistor. So the bits are represented by certain orientations of magnetic fields which should not have any effect on gravitational mass. But in hard disk, the orientation of magnetic domains will change when we put some extra data into a hard disk. Each magnetic domain corresponds has some energy. Then a related question would be if a hard drive is filled with purely random data, would that weight any differently than a hard drive filled with meaningful data? I mean, is there any difference between random data and meaningful data in the sense of weight? The answer is yes. Why? Because when we put some extra data into a hard disk, the energy of each domain increases. That is, we have supply energy to each domain to orient or align the magnetic domain in a particular direction. This supplied energy will stored in the magnetic domain as a potential energy. Most importantly, higher information content correlates with a more energetic configuration. And this is true regardless the particular type of storage. Now as per Einstein most famous formula E is equal mc2 says that energy is equivalent to mass. So E is equal to mc2 makes clear the potential energy stored in the magnetic domain due to the orientation is equivalent to mass and will have weight. Mathematically it can be calculated that 4 gigabyte memory this would mean a rough increase in weight of 10 to the power minus 18 grams. So for a full 1 TB hard disk the increase in weight will be 2.56 into 10 to the power minus 16 gram. So certainly this value is very less than what you would be able to feel. The main point I want to make is that no matter what assumptions you make the weight difference is too small to measure. So finally the weight of a full hard disk is greater than an empty hard disk drive. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like this video and please don't forget to share this curious question to your friends. So this much for today. Stay tuned with Physics Boy for the next curious question and scientific explanation.